Hello everyone, it's Kitaki here. Um, today we're bringing you the semi-final match of the PWC Season 4. We are in semi-finals. If we beat Destiny today, we will make it to finals. And um, the next match we already played, which uh, Dave Fireking won, so we would have a chance to play him. But um, this is kind of already late. Like the tournament already finished. I just didn't want to record because um, I was kind of busy and... And I was kind of upset at the same time. I don't want to spoil it before anything before the match. So let's get right into it. First of all, how much Ranita here? Um, I forgot what set is it. I'm not even gonna try to remember. I know I have a Life Orb Stoutland, a Choice Band Stoutland here with Return, Iron Head, Crunch, and I believe uh, Superpower last move. Then we have a Physically Defensive Chestnut just because it walls the the um, Exca drill and you can also take hits from Keldeo pretty well we have a choice scarf guard chomp with if you see Destin Stim choice scarf guard chomp puts in the finest of work with a uh, earthquake I believe we had Draco Meteor or our I don't quite remember well but choice scarf guard chomp it was suspected to do a lot of work uh, then we have a uh, coal mine Latias with store power recover coal mine and uh, Refresh as the last move as you can see the this is biggest threat to my team is the Mega Diancy However, if I set up with my Latias before he can Moonblast me a bunch of times We will be good to go uh, and to kill the Excadrill even the Metagross But that's not gonna be the case cuz um, I should have put more defense on these Latias only put 100 EVs I should have put more His speed wasn't really necessary the Latias, it was basically like a wall, setup wall. But yeah, then we have a Raichu, which we brought because we expected him to bring his Gobantula, which he didn't. I was kind of surprised at that. I did not expect it to see Metagross, honestly. Because as you can see, my team can deal pretty well with Metagross. But uh, we have a Fake Out, Wadmel Berry, Natural Gift, Raichu. The point of this was to Fake Out the Gobantula and Natural Gift Fire to, ki to kill it and prevent webs completely. And then I believe Bolt Tackle was the last move and Iron Tail. Just because I speed out with the Diancy and I could have like killed if I went to speed out with the Iron Tail. So we're gonna start the match. He's gonna start with Shamus. We start with Raichu. We're gonna go right for Fake Out. He was gonna go for Natural Gift, but I feared the Earth Power. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch right into Ladia. So he goes for Toxic, right? And here uh, it was a good prediction for him, but we're just gonna go for a fresh here. And honestly, in these first turns is where the match um, was decided. Because I go for a coal mine, I go for a nice punch. It was 33%. Here's if, we, if I had a more defense investment. Here I go for a, not a recover to be a fool. He, he crits me with ice punch for a recover again, and he crits me once again. So yeah, this match was pretty hacksy, but the way I played it, I feel it had an impact on that. So. Here we're gonna come in again because I know we can take the next ice punch pretty easily. However, I'm playing with fire here. I'm already at plus two, but I'm playing with fire because you know ice punch has a 10% chance to freeze. If I would have more defense, I wouldn't have been taking this much better instead of a possible three hit KO, it would have been a four hit KO. And here was the killer. Uh one or here. But as you can see on turn eleven, I got my third coal mine. At this point I have a roll to 2 hit KO the Metagross. However, I want to be a, a better health to take on the rest of his teams because at this point I could just literally win. Here I go for another Calm Mine, he goes for another Ice Punch, he did the 13 Ice Punch, so 12, and he freezes me. And here's what it wouldn't matter if I had more defense because I really to take two more Ice Punch instead of just one. And this kind of blows, I really wanted to throw out first turn there, but because uh, I would have basically won. He was already down to like 15 ice punch. Here, um, this was a questionable play in my side. However, I was left with, what, hold up, 15. Let me see. Here I get frozen, ice punch. I was left with 24% health. I thought he was gonna switch and expected me to switch instead of sacking my Latias. Because I could bring my Latias back on the Shaman. And 
or or, or the cow deal if it like locks himself into like secrets or whatever. So I decided to save it. So I expected him, expected from Destin to go for either a medium mash or a bullet punch if he had it. I don't think bullet push kill, but medium mash was the play here because if I were to switch and to like anything else, it would have been much better. But either way, this this meta goes switch is a problem for a team. So I switched directly into Garchomp's Wish, which was my mistake, because I just lose my Garchomp for nothing. And this Garchomp could have literally put in so much work. As I go into Chestnut, and you're going to see later on that, that Ice Punch only does like, I don't know, like, um, yeah, I try to bring back my Laddie, but it's going to be very hard for me to bring it back at this point. Anyways, the Ice Punch just like 20 something percent to Chestnut, so instead of switching Garchomp in on, on that, uh, Chestnut would have definitely been the best play. Here I'm already down my Lattice and my Garchomp, which are the two most that pressure Destin so much. Here I'm trying to get damage on this Diancy, because this thing just destroys my entire team. Here we're going to switch into Stoutland, because I expected him to switch there. We try to play uh, as best as we can. He goes for Seed for he misses. Thankfully, we avoid that there, because this Stoutland can 2 hit his entire team. He's gonna go ahead and sack off Shaman. He doesn't really need it, to be honest. Then he brings this Metagross once again, and here's where he goes for the Ice Punch. You see, that only did 29%. So instead of bringing my Garchomp, I should have bring it to Chestnut, and we would have been fine. Garchomp would have still been alive. Here we're gonna go for a Lead Seed. I should have gone for Seed Bone there, because uh, we would have been getting rid of this Diancy. As you can see, he's gonna for Moonblast Weed or Rosalie Berry. We live. And Seedbone does 85%. So how, how do we go for Seedbone? Or even Drain Punch there. We would have been able to kill the answer. We would have been in a, actually a much better position. Because Stoutland was uh, more free to um, click uh, click moves. And even like my Raichu would have speed the majority of his team. So we bring Titar again. He just Moonblasted. I know we could have lived one. But we cannot live two. As I can tell, as I'm telling you, this Diancy is such a problem here. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna sack Chestnut. As Destin, uh, he was Sand Rush Escadrille, he was using my Sand this entire time. And I thought he was a Scar, so that's a good thing for him. Had it I known that, I would sack Tyranitar to make their Sand run out. Here I know he's gonna go for a Protect. I'm just trying to, trying to find a way to outplay this Diancy and bring this game back. But it's gonna be very difficult because of my guard. Here, I go for a ball tackle. I, I kind of thought he was gonna switch to Excadrill there. I should have gone for the the one the, the he, natural get fire, but I didn't. I didn't trigger the. I didn't put the trigger there. I should have. If I get rid of this Excadrill, actually had a a good shot with Raichu. We could have uh, potentially win, but. That's not gonna happen. We're gonna sack off the Excadrill here. We're gonna go into Stoutland. He's gonna go. He's gonna switch. He's still. Um, I'm gonna kill the Bocarona with crit it, but it burns us. And this basically wraps it up. Oh, anyways, he was still. Um, how do you say it? He was hiding the fact that he was Sun Rush. And yeah, the reason why this wraps it up is because uh, Stoutland was my only chance of winning. I had a plan to lock myself into a Choice Bandit Crunch. At some point on the game where I could have KO Metagross, leave Keldia weakened enough to where Raichu could have win. But the Flame Body uh, really messed me up here because I couldn't, I can get another win, another kill. But then again, he comes into Excadrill, choice that his Sans Rush and destroys me. So yeah, I should have gone, I could have gone for Fake Out, but that wouldn't make any difference. So one more Sand turn. So Destin beats me 4-0. I feel like I played super bad. I played terrible. We lose on the semifinals of the PWC, the season four to be exact. And the finals already played out. And guess what? Destin won. Destin beat Dave. He became the champion. Kinda like us last season where he barely, barely made it. He only made it for differential kills. Two playoffs. He won um I he beat Turkey, which had a really good season on the quarters. He beat me, which I had a, I feel like I had a decently good season at the beginning. And then he proceeded to have 
to be day we has had the most kills of the season and he just did really good he used Bocarona and Excadrilla at a really good level I would spoil the I would not spoil the the final result between him and Dave but I'm gonna link the battle on the channel so you can go see it so Dusty became the champion and he, it was a pretty good match so he definitely played better than me I know I could have done a little bit things better uh, differently but yeah suddenly I feel like this is like my best draft ever and we lost I was really wanting to win but couldn't happen so next season let's see how it goes hopefully we can we can win next season um, I'm gonna try to draft a more offensively team I feel but we're going to have the Gen 7 month, so it's going to be pretty interesting. We'll see how that happens. So, yeah, thank you for watching. This is the end of the road for us. Congrats to Destin who won. The bitch has freezed me. He always grits me, dude, I swear. But it doesn't really matter. I play with fire. I got burned. So, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.